23 ABC's digital update is brought to you by West Medical. Good evening, I'm Keely Van Middendorp. Here's what's making headlines from across the county. Houchin Community Blood Bank is in need of blood. Now it is offering up a big prize for people who donate. Starting July 1st, you can get entered to win a car. Houchin is partnering with Three Way Chevrolet to donate that car to someone who donates blood or other materials in the next few months. If you donate blood, you will have two chances if you donate every 56 days. Plasma gets you four chances when donating every four weeks. And if you donate platelets, you'll get 16 chances to win if you donate every seven days. We have more information on our website about how to sign up for the raffle, which ends on October 31st. California Highway Patrol wants drivers to get ready for a maximum enforcement period this week. This means more officers will be on the roads monitoring drunk drivers and speeders in advance of the 4th of July holiday. The operation starts Friday at 6 p.m. and lasts until midnight on July 5th. Well, another city in the county has announced it will be holding a fireworks show this weekend. McFarland will hold its annual 4th of July celebration on Saturday, which is July 3rd. The fireworks are set to go off starting at 9 p.m. You should be able to see the show from any of the parks in McFarland. More details on our websites. Well, today, day four of our heat wave, high temperature 105, second warmest day of our heat wave so far. Temperatures slowly dropping from here, but staying in the triple digits. So the heat wave continues as we head through the forecast. 102 in Bakersfield for tomorrow, 104 at Arvin, one, right about 106 over at Ridgecrest, and still right around 100 degrees toward Lake Isabella as well. So lots of triple digits again tomorrow and lots of triple digits as we step through the forecast. It's definitely possible we could see some upper 90s mixed in here, but the potential is there for highs at or above 100 for the next seven days. So it could be a very long lived heat wave, not a particularly intense one, but very long lived. We do bring back some small shower chances and storm chances Friday and Saturday for Lake Isabella, but overall the forecast just calls for plenty of heat. And that's your latest news and weather update for the latest update anytime. Be sure to head to our website, turn to 23.com.